Okay, setting the alarm to seven minutes starting now. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Skylar. So basically, I saw Jen did this strip down challenge on her video on her channel, and I feel like why not? She tagged all video creators, so maybe I should do one as well. So um, I usually rely on video edits a lot because I am from Taiwan. I don't speak English every day, so sometimes I have to look the vocabulary up or sometimes I just speak weird English and I have to speak it again and to edit out the words, the bad parts. So, so you can already listen to me not speaking good English. So this is like my rawest form, so I hope you guys can bear with me. And I'm going to talk to you guys about the random stuff that is happening in my life. And I hope you guys can sit down and enjoy. So I am actually under a lot of stress right now. I'm not very happy in school, so sometimes I don't know why I don't have like a best friend in life. Maybe it's because I usually build up a wall on around my heart and I don't easily let people in. That's how I am. And basically all of my best um like I don't know, like like, 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 like. All I can say is like. So basically it takes time for me to fully trust one person. But in college, when you basically don't spend that much time with each other, it's hard for you to understand the other person and it's hard for you to fully trust them. So it's kind of hard for me. And as a girl who used to care a lot for their friends, it, it's kind of making me feel lonely because I feel that... I'm so different and hardly anybody accepts me and that is just weird and hard. So that's probably one of the reasons why I started filming videos because this is the only reason I, like the only way I could express my feelings instead of, like I don't go on Facebook that much anymore because I feel like Facebook has already been, is already turning into a place full of advertisements and it is boring. Oh, by the way, um, I recently uh, joined a fandom, in case you guys didn't know. Fandom is not bad, okay? Fandom is good. So basically, I met a, a few college girls in this fandom, and we even created a WhatsApp group chat. It's weird how people living so far away from you could be important, like way more important to you compared to your real life friends. like. Sometimes you feel like you cannot fully reveal your feelings to your real life friends, but to your internet friends, you can because if, if you're bonding through internet, it obviously means something. It means that you can trust them even when you don't know them in your real life. And this kind of bond, like we have the we have this time difference thing and Whenever I woke, woke, wake, whenever I wake up, I could like I wake up to like so many WhatsApp messages, and I sometimes just see my English sucks. I sometimes just scroll through the messages, and they actually make my day. So I'm, ha I'm very happy that I met them through this Twitter fandom, and it makes my day. So uh, I don't know what else I can talk about. What else can I talk about? My life is boring, and I hope you guys are still watching this video because I'm not going to edit it and it will be weird so what else can I do? let's talk about what can we talk about? okay, uh, don't leave please I'm thinking about things I can talk about okay, what else can I talk about? I really don't know what I can talk about ah, so um, I hate myself I probably shouldn't even do this challenge, okay. Um, okay. I plan on moving to America for a while and when I graduate college because I don't know. I basically am a banana. AKA a banana is a banana. Banana? Banana. Banana. Okay, a banana is basically like me. I am yellow on the outside but white in the inside. I think a lot like Americans and that is weird that is so not cool but it's some sometimes also the reason why I cannot 
fully blend in with the people around me because they are all into K-pop or Japanese or Taiwan like I'm into America and my English is okay and their English is not okay so whenever I just burst out into English they cannot understand what I'm saying and I have to translate it into Chinese and things will just get awkward and I will just get awkward so I'm an awkward person yeah my life is so pathetic I'm like Asian Asian students have pathetic lives I have like in college I have weekly tests and it is really stressing me out I haven't been happy I haven't been happy I wasn't I haven't oh, I hate these tenses I wasn't happy for a very long time and I'm still not happy right now. I'm working on something that can make me feel happier and I hope it works. If it works, I'm gonna tell you guys. If it not, if it doesn't work, this secret will be forever inside my heart and you guys will never know. So um thank you guys. I have one question to ask you guys. Why do you guys subscribe to me? Because I'm obviously not like those mainstream youtubers I don't at the moment I don't really have time to do skits and I don't really have time to make amazing videos compared to awesome youtubers so I'm very curious why you guys subscribe to me because my video is very simple and it basically is just me talking to camera and nothing else so I'm really curious so also I'm wondering if you guys like I only have 132 subscribers right now so a lot of you guys have been asking me do I have a Facebook fan page or do I have um, I don't know ask Skylar things or do I have anything oh! it's up okay I'm gonna talk for a little while what am I okay do I have um do I like to host something, for example, like Ask Either or anything else? I just feel like I don't have enough subscribers, so I'm not going to do that at the moment. But if I gain a reasonably a number, a certain number of subscribers, I would do it. So yeah, let's all pray and wish I get there. So yeah, seven minutes is up. I feel like that this past seven minutes is torture to me because... Uh, I hope I didn't make you guys feel awkward. So, yeah, this is the real me, the rawest form. I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect. And nobody's perfect, but accept accept your flaws and believe in yourself because although we're not perfect, we can be awesome. So, thank you guys for bearing with me and watching this weird video, the strip down challenge thanks to Genexpet. So, Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, remember to subscribe and check out my other edited videos. Remember to give me a like if you like my rawest form. And remember to comment down below answering some of my questions. I mentioned in the video, I, I already forgot what I asked, but yeah, I, I'm old, so I don't have long, term, long, long memories. But thank you guys so much. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for bearing with me. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!